another package. What we we have here? What's in this one? This one's kind of light though. It's unboxing. Let's see what we got. Good tape on that. Told y'all, man. I'm going back to my roots this year. That down there. Y'all need to see that. Oh, man. Small box. Small box today. Nice box, though. What do we have in this one? What's in this one? All right, y'all. So, no delay on this one. It's right here. Something I got for myself that I didn't even actually know Nike made until recently. Voila. We got the Nike Air Max Slides. These things are nice. They light, super light. So yeah, you know I had to hit y'all with these. So not only am I gonna do a review on these, I'm also gonna do a comparison. Cause these right here, I'm not gonna lie, these Adidas slides, these uh, cloud forms, these are like Adidas lights, I believe. These things are comfortable. So they are gonna have to really step it up. They are gonna really have to step it up, Nike, to, be, to get on the level of this one. But I'm gonna test these out and see, um, but it does have the air bubble. So that's one sign that this should be a, somewhat comfortable. But uh, like I said, I'm gonna see how this feels. Shoe look kind of small too. Had to go with a 10. Um, my normal size in Nike is actually a 10 and a half, but I had to go with 10 because they didn't have size in the slides and then 11s were sold out. So hopefully these fit. If not, then I'll be sending them back. But uh, let me hit you guys with a quick review and some B-roll of the shoe. at the table those that watch the channel know that but i'm gonna do my review right here standing up um i gotta be honest with you guys these shoes they're not that comfortable um i really don't feel the air bubble at all the black portion that the the footbed is kind of hard it almost feels like a like a cheap shower shoe to be honest um they're kind of tight. The over layer that goes over the foot is kind of tight. Like I said, I had to go with a smaller size, so I understand that, so I won't knock them for that. But um, they do fit, they still fit. It's just like a tighter squeeze. I work my foot in there and I, I get in there. Um, it's not like choking my foot or anything like that though, so that's a plus. Uh, let me just show you guys. So yeah, it's not like choking my foot or anything like that, but... Uh, it's definitely like a tight fit, but it doesn't feel like, it doesn't hurt, let me put it that way. But the shoes definitely aren't that comfortable, especially compared to my Adidas. So I'm just gonna be honest with you guys, the Adidas Adelite uh, slides are just more comfortable. They're softer, 
They feel better. Um, these feel like I'm gonna have to break them in or something. Like really putting in some work. But like I said, even when I break them in, that uh, that footbed right here, this black footbed, as you can see, it's pretty hard. And that air bubble ain't really, not really doing too much. It's not really doing too much. But with that being said, but with that being said, they're not bad. It's just that once you compare them to something else that you know for a fact feels better, it's kind of like, eh, but it's still not a bad slide. Um, I got these off the Nike website for like 50 bucks. So I do like the look of them. I do like the look. So if you like the look, if you, um, I don't know, you should probably try them out. You may, it may, you might like the rough feel or whatnot, the shower type feel, the shower shoe. It's just not really my thing, but uh, it's kind of, I don't like mix matching things either. I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I don't like wearing Adidas slides with Nike clothes or whatever, Nike gear, Nike shirt, whatever. I like to kind of match my brands. I don't like mix matching brands unless it's a designer brand and I wear that with like Nike or something or Adidas. But uh, I don't I do not do the whole Adidas and Nike thing because that just ain't my style. You can do whatever you want to do because you buy your own clothes. But me personally, I like to match brands with the same brand as far as sneaker brands. With that being said, thank you for tuning in to another episode of Rituals. Uh, hit that subscribe button for your boy. Do that right now. If you like sneaker reviews, I got a ton of those coming. I also have a ton of those already uploaded, so go back and watch the old videos. But I got some shoes coming in the mail. We're gonna do some reviews on that. I got some resale uh, value videos coming up, so we'll talk about StockX. And I know you guys, some of you guys don't come to the channel just for shoes. Some of you guys don't care less about shoes. You guys come for Black Eagle content, which is my BMW M2. I got some M2 videos coming up. Got a real good video coming up. Um, BMW just actually gave me something. They actually gave your boy something. So I really appreciate that. That video is coming real soon. Uh, so hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell so you know when I'm gonna upload videos so you stay in the loop, you're the first. Uh, comment below. Give me some suggestions. What videos you would like to see? Would you like to see more car videos? Would you like to see more uh, sneaker reviews? I also do some lifestyle stuff. I uploaded a video a few minutes ago about how to make a vegetable and fruit smoothie because that's health. De rituals mean daily practice of building wealth. And one way to build wealth is take care of your health. So go and watch that video about how to make a vegetable and fruit smoothie because that's actually beneficial to your life. With that being said, thank you for tuning in. Hit that comment section. Let your boy know how you're liking the videos. And once again, I appreciate you all. Peace.